I'd like to say something about Lagba Omer. It's a wonderful thing to celebrate about Rav Shimon ben Yochai. It's a wonderful thing to recognize the fact that Am Yisrael is blessed by the Torah of Nigla, Shas, and by the Torah of Nistar, which was evolved or devolved into the Zohar. And therefore there's no doubt that Rav Shimon ben Yochai, whose name is associated with the creation or the reformulation of the Torah Sad Nistar, should receive approbation. And therefore, in Eretz Yisrael, the fact that going to Meiron has become a kind of national holiday is something that seems to me to be reasonable. It represents the spirit of Am Yisrael to a certain extent. However, making of bonfires, building of bonfires by children is not to my mind positive, practical, or effective. The children spend a lot of time collecting the wood and uh, making sure that the bonfire will be the biggest one in the city and then the post-mortem is always, that one was bigger than this one. And this year, did you see this or did you see that? And people are willing to ignore two serious problems. One is that every year there are children who are hurt, sometimes very seriously, by uh, the fires that they themselves have built. Secondly, the smoke that sometimes gets into your house, gets into everything that you own, and gets into the people who live in your house, is certainly not doing anybody any good. So I have thought for many years that it wouldn't it be good if we could harness the energy that goes into building bonfires in some way. Perhaps the neighborhoods should decide on a bonfire. A bonfire where all the fathers could watch and make sure that the safety of their children was intact. It seems to me that there's a very simple Torah principle about pikuach nefesh, about saving lives. And it would seem to me that a simple extension would be don't put yourself into physical danger. And if this works for curtailing cigarette smoke, it, this works for telling people that they can't smoke any longer in the Beit Midrash, it should certainly work for damping down the banned bonfires that are made on Lagba Omer. And so with this, I wish you a wonderful day. Lagba Omer should only bring joy to the parents and to the children. But let's try to make the bonfires a side feature of the day and make thinking about and working towards understanding the legacy of Rav Shibun ben Yochai, the primary interest that we have on that day.